Hello, this is the presentation of the paper, Personalized Multimodal Generation with Large Language Models. Personalization is essential for improving user experience and better meeting users' needs. In the example of a chat tool, when the user types in, I'm happy, the chat tool understands the sentiment and provides smiley faces as emoticons of happy for the user to choose and click. For personalization, the chat tool would be able to identify user interests through user behavior and then generate personalized emoticons. In the example, the user has used many emoticons of cats and said, I like cute cats. We think she may be a cat lover and replace the normal emoticons with smiling cute cats. In the example of online advertisement, normally when we need an advertisement for shirts, we generate an image of a shirt. For personalization, we analyze the user's historical click items and extract user preferences, cartoon, and bear. Then we generate a shirt with cartoon bear patterns which is more appealing to the user. Besides, personalization generation can also be used in video games, intelligent assistants, and so on. To address the aforementioned applications, we propose personalized multimodal generation using LLMs, PMG for short. PMG utilizes an LLM to extract the user's preferences from the user's behavior history, such as clicks in recommender systems or past conversations. The information of the target item, which means the item we aim to generate is also extracted by the LLM. Then the user preferences condition and target item condition are fed into a generator to produce personalized content. The main challenge is that representing user preferences as natural language may not be accurate, because they have limited expressive ability, whereas user preferences are abstract. For example, when generating cartoon shoes, the generator has no idea of generating cartoon drawings of shoes or shoes with cartoon decorations. To address this, we propose to generate implicit embeddings via a trainable bias correction LLM to better capture user preferences. In our experiments, we test the generation of PMG in three scenarios. While generating movie posters, PMG generates cute posters in cartoon style for cartoon lovers, posters with crime and disaster for thriller lovers, and posters of love for romance lovers. The results of costumes and emoticons also show the effectiveness of PMG. For quantitative experiments, we evaluated the generation effect on two datasets and invited volunteers to do human evaluation. The images generated by PMG achieve an improvement for up to 8% in LPIPS, 50% in SSM, and an average of 24% score. Thanks for watching.